Groups in Mahara Groups. Apart from creating content, you can also create and manage groups in Mahara. Groups can be classes, single lessons, private groups, or other. Every user can create groups. Go to the burger menu and choose Engage and Groups from the drop down menu. Then, in the view that opens, click on Plus Create Group. When creating a new group, you must give it a name. A description of the group helps other users find the right groups to join. Manage the membership in the settings. Here you can define whether the group be open or closed. Open means that anybody can join without invitation or approval. If the group is not open, membership requests can be approved by group administrators. That makes the admission to groups controllable. Further settings are explained directly in Mahara and can be managed there. This is the view of a new Mahara group. This is where you find the title and the description. Furthermore, you can find other important information here, such as the number of members or the creation date. This view of the group also displays the latest posts as well as the group portfolios. And of course, you can also see all the single group members. Members. In order to manage the members of a group, choose the menu item Members. Besides seeing the group members, you can also add new members here. Adding multiple members is done by selecting their names in the list. You can enter their names in the search bar and then add them manually. In order to make this easier for entire classes, students can request admission to a group. For this, the settings mentioned before need to be set correctly. To join a group, select Groups in the drop down menu on the right hand side. Now select which groups should be visible in the search bar. If all settings are correct, the group you want to join should be visible in Groups I'm not in and All Groups. Once you have found the right group, you can request to join this group. Or you can directly join this group. Forums. Groups are forums which can be selected in the menu bar. A new forum can be created with a title and a description, and you can manage the settings. Depending on the settings selected, any person or only specified persons can create a new discussion. The forums are similar to those on the eCampus. Now, group members can react to this post. Pages and collections. You can also create pages or collections in a group. Do this by clicking Pages and Collections. This is identical to what we explained in video 1, First Steps in Mahara. If you don't want to create a page directly in the group, you can share one with the group by managing the access as described earlier. Just choose the appropriate group in the access settings. You can look up the access in reports. Depending on the settings chosen, these pages can be reviewed and commented. Watch lists. When creating a shared page, you can put it on a watch list or remove it. Correspondingly, you would receive notifications of changes or not. If you do not want to receive notifications, simply remove the page from the watch list. Support. If you have any questions or need support, please refer to the university's IT support for technical issues or the Skills Center for educational questions or issues with Mahara.